cities are key to countering climate change. Did you know that 80% of global energy consumption and 70% of global carbon emissions comes from cities? Urbanization is a strong megatrend. As a matter of fact, by 2050, 70% of humanity is expected to live in a city. This urge to urbanize comes from mainly three factors, access to healthcare, access to education, and job opportunities. Social networking comes on top of this. My job is to understand the practical implications of urbanization. Which investment opportunities arise as a consequence of this shift from rural to urban areas? More specifically, I do analysis to find companies that create value through solving some of these urban challenges. Some of the issues that arise from urbanization are air pollution. Air pollution is an example of a major challenge that has sparked significant change already. Reducing air pollution can solve both environmental and social issues. As cities worldwide are battling these tiny particles that pose serious health threats to humans, they can also cut emissions since the majority of air pollution comes from burning fossil fuels. Some examples that can solve and reduce air pollution are renewable energies, zero emission mobility and energy efficient heating and cooling of buildings. Finance represents the ability to shift capital. Capital allocation, combined with the influence of active ownership, represents the ability to accelerate change. There is still time to invest for a green transition. We can set capital to work. While time is of the, time is of the essence, we need to invest in climate-related solutions, clean technologies, and by doing this, we can see green solutions materialize. Governments worldwide have set clear targets to shift capital in order to reach their climate ambitions. The International Monetary Fund, IMF, has estimated that in order to reach a net zero society by 2050, we need an additional investment in the scale of 1% of annual global GDP. That accumulates to approximately 20 trillion US dollars. At the same time, cities worldwide need to adapt to a changing climate. Therefore, we need to invest in climate resilient infrastructure so that the cities can tackle the ever-increasing storms, floods and heavy rainfall, in addition to droughts. In order to make this happen, we need to invest in sound water management, urban planning and zero emission mobility to ensure resource efficiency and energy efficiency. An example of a solution are green roofs. Green roofs can absorb up to 80% of rainfall. Natural basins with vegetation and the reopening of rivers that today run beneath our cities can delay water floods and prevent flooding from happening in the first place. I do thematic solutions analysis to find companies that solve some of the major challenges linked to urbanization. More specifically, I see companies that have sustainable business models with products and services that help contribute to the UN Sustainable Development Goals. We call these companies solution companies. Solution themes that enable clean air and clean water for urban inhabitants can be linked to investment themes such as water, mobility and urban planning. 
I seek investing in companies that are well positioned for future growth. I am a portfolio manager for a fund that focuses specifically on solution companies that contribute to solve major urban challenges. The fund invests in 50 to 70 companies and investors in the fund thereby owns a small share of the very same companies that together constitute a portfolio. Investment opportunities often develop in tight correlation with new governmental targets and regulations. Scientists tell us that we have little time left in order to reach a net zero society by 2050. Finance does not provide all the answers. However, it can be used as an accelerator for change. We need change to a green transition and we need it now. Financial returns is the primary target for a portfolio manager. For me, the primary motivation is not merely financial returns. It is a value beyond return. An urban global population concentrates both the challenges but also the opportunities to solve them. Therefore, cities are key to countering climate change. Thank you.